Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I'm super excited for this video. It is an unboxing of my mystery magical wand. This is from Noble Wands and for once I'm actually opening a mystery parcel on time. Usually they sit in my house for like ages and ages and then I open it. But not this time, it arrived on Thursday the 20th. No, it would have been Thursday the 28th of February and this is for February. This is February's wand. So a little bit about Noble Wands. So Noble Wands, it's a mystery box for wands, so you just get a wand and a little like detail card. I don't know where my wand is behind me. No, there was one behind me, but I've got no idea where it is. I don't even think I've got the wand on display. I have had one before, I had last month. Last month was really weird, it kind of like, I liked it, but at the same time I did it, and my first thing was that it looked like a cat toy. But if you want to see what I actually thought about that, the first one, check out my video, I'll try and remember to put a link down below to get you to that one. But if not, it'll be in the playlist, Noble, I think it's called like Noble Wands or something. But anyway, so, each month you get a mystery wand, it's $14.99 plus postage, and I think that's everything really about it, it's just different stuff. It's quite cool if you're like a magical fan or a Harry Potter fan. Because the ones aren't actually Harry Potter like base, they're not like Ron Weasley's wand or like, you know, like actual Harry Potter ones. That's quite cool because you have to remember Ollivander's shop had loads and loads of wands. So you could collect all these wands and get a cool collection in, mixed up with all your Harry Potter ones and they all kind of look like Ollivander's shop. Which I think is pretty cool and that's kind of what my idea is going to. Anyway, let's open it. I'm going to try and open it whilst I've got a cat on my lap. And we'll see what happens. She decided to jump up and she wants to be in video but she won't. So, ugh. It comes like this and on the dress where it says return like dress it's called geeky craft stuff because i think noble wands is like a branch out of geeky craft stuff and geeky craft stuff the ones that do geek gear subscription boxes but that's the i think the actual company is called geeky craft stuff and then they obviously have like different things so they've got geek bit box and then like geek wear and now noble wands so they're just branching out a bit but this is what it looks like this comes in a pack this is fragile Hopefully I don't need scissors to get into this because I'm not going to be able to move now that there's a creature on me. Can you like see her tail? I don't know if you can see it. It's just right under my arm. And now she's just nudging me. Can I get into this please? Do we need scissors? I can't get scissors because you're on me aren't you? Oh she's looking at me. Oh we're getting there. Are you going to get in there ways? Maybe you'll like it. It might be a cat toy for you again. I don't know why I put the other one, I think it's just here, down next to the salt and how I think that's where the other one went, so they never actually um, kept it open. So then it comes bubble wrap, which is quite handy because I actually need some bubble wrap, so that worked out quite well. And let's open the bubble wrap. Ooh, so many packages, so much packaging, why can't I open the bubble wrap? There you go. And then we come in our box, so it's a very basic box, it just says trademark, noble ones on the front, and then it says it again on the back. Can you guys see that or is it going to be glaring? So let's open it up without dropping it. Oh the card's going to fall out. Okay I'm going to open it. See? There you go the card fell out. Oh so this one's just a basic black one. I like this one. Is it meant to be a crow? I think it's meant to be a crow. Wiggles can you get off my lap so I can get the box please darling. The box? The card. Okay. Oh I dropped it. That's exactly what happened to me last time. I dropped it. So the card. Let's do that bit first. This is what the card looks like. It is very basic. I did say in my other video that I was quite disappointed with how the card looks, just because I just thought it would be nice to have a bit different. So it's called the Super Superbia wand. The length is 13 and a half inches, which is the same as the other one. It's fe the, fest the Festral Tail Hair. I know I've not said it right, but I can't pronounce my T's and H's. Um, wood type is ebony, so that's quite cool. So it is just a nice, I guess hopefully you guys can see it. Please don't have a glare. Can you guys see that? I'm in my spare room, my lighting isn't very great because it's miserable today and I usually work with natural lighting. But there you go. So that's not too bad. And then the one itself, I actually really like this one. So again, got a nice, so the painting's not brilliant, like the other one as well, I said it looked a bit, I'm guessing this is meant to be black. And the other one as well, like maybe obviously like brown, but it had like a purpley tinge. And again, I don't know, maybe it's just my eyes, maybe I need to wear my eyes more. But it does look very plasticky and cheap, this does, compared to like other Harry Potter ones. But obviously they still look plasticky, but like this one has like a shine on it, which makes it super shiny, whereas these are like dull, so they look more wood-like. So that is my only down thing about it, they've shined these up a bit to make them, obviously like seal in the paint I guess, or whatever. 
but now they look too shiny and I don't like that. I might have to like sand it down or something. But I really do love it because of the head. I love, love, love the top. I don't know if that's, I think it's meant to be a crow. I, I'm pretty sure that's, ah! I knocked a camera tripod. I was trying to get closer to you, there's a pillow behind me and I don't want it to fall. But, oh, come on, let's go. I don't know if you guys can see, I think it is meant to be a crow. Can you guys see that? Hopefully your camera's focusing. Hopefully. Can your camera's focusing? I think it might be. But I do, I actually really like the head. Because it's simple, the other one was very extravagant. I was trying to think of the right word then. Yeah, um, it's early, okay? And I'm like losing blood. That's a whole nother story, but I'm losing blood quite just ridiculously. It's just stupid. But I like this one. This one is very simple. The other one was all like fancy and had like feathers on it where it didn't really need those. Whereas this one is simple and I kind of imagine this would be one like kind of like a bad, maybe like a Slytherin would have kind of wand or like someone high up would have just because of like a simple yet this kind of like got the crow which is kind of like a symbol of death because it's a group of crows that call a murder or is that ravens whatever but I think I'm pretty sure this is going to be a crow it looks like the tattoo that I've got so and I love crows so I'm actually really chuffed with that one I can't I, I just want you guys to see it and I don't know if it's really showing you guys can I like put it against my arm is that going to like help I need like a background all I've got is a sparkly one and I don't think it's going to show on the black uh -oh. So there you have it, that is the wand. I'm happy with this one, I like this one. This one will definitely go on display. I have to put it back in the box now though. Alright, I won't have it. It's good weight as well, did I tell you guys that? Okay, I missed that. The other one had quite good weight, this one has quite good weight as well, like you can do your tricks and like catch it. This, this one's a good weight, it feels a lot lighter actually. I think the weight is a bit more distributed, a bit better than the other one. And then I drop it. Hey hey, welcome to my channel. I drop things and kick my tripod. What's going on with me today? It's too early. I don't do mornings, that's what it is. I don't do mornings, but I've got loads of videos to record, I've got a really busy day, so I'm trying to do as much as I can. Anyway, so that's this wand. I do like this one. This one is definitely going to go on display. I have to find a way to display my ones, because I now have... I've got one, two, three, four, five Harry Potter ones, and then two of these now. So these come out each month, like I said. I think they get like posted around like the 21st, 22nd of the month. And then you should get them at the end of the month, slash so the beginning of the next month, roughly. But they're $14.99 a month. Um, postage, I think, is like $2.99, $3.99. I can't remember how, post how much postage is. But I think it's quite good because, like, I pay $15 for, like, this one, my Voldemort one, I got from BM, and I paid $15.99. No, $14.99 for that one. $15.99 for that one at BM. So. I think it's still quite a good price because the quality is about similar to like the B&M ones and yeah it's wand and I love it. So there we have it. If you want to get your own Noble Wands I'll put the link down below for you and you can check them out and see if you want them. I think you can also buy, they're going to have it so that you can buy ones when, after a while that you can buy the ones that they've like passed, like passed boxes because they don't really need a box, like a past, past wand. You can buy them in the future I think. But, like I said, this is only the second month for them having it, it's only the second month for me doing it. I think I'm going to continue for maybe like two more months and then decide if I want to continue like fully or not. Because after a while, I don't want to get too many ones that I don't really like. Like last month I, I weren't keen on, this month I'm really keen on. So we'll see how next month goes and just decide from there kind of thing. But, I'm sorry I probably rambled a lot. I really like ones and I like this one. This is probably my favourite one and I can't wait. But as soon as I turn this camera off, I'm sending my sister a picture of it because I'm really happy that it totally goes with like me. <laughs> this is like me in a nutshell. It's black and it's um kind of simple because I'm kind of simple. And it's a crow and I love crows. I'm really weird, I don't know. Anyway, that is seriously everything. I am going to shout now. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I put up videos every Wednesday and every Sunday. And if you like this video, hit that like button. If you've got any comments, let me know in the comments below. And that is seriously everything. I am trying to find some more subscription boxes actually. So if you guys know any that are good, let me know. Because all the ones that I used to do seem to have gone downhill. So I'm struggling to find new ones so I could do with some new subscription boxes. Anyway, I really am going to shout out. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a great morning, after evening, whatever the time it is. I hope you have been smiling because that's the most important thing. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!